They're all standing on number three court looking down because there's action at four. This is court five, and it could clinch the national championship. Stanford is the 2019 NCAA Women's Division I Tennis Champion. It's always a goal for us to win a national championship and we had an amazing senior class that left us last year um, and we really wanted to send them off on a really great note. We won it my freshman year and that only makes you hungrier to win it every year. Um, so we came in really excited for the season but we take it one step at a time so getting conference and then getting the bid to host all three rounds um, was really a main goal for us and then obviously doing well in the final rounds is obviously a big deal as well. 19 was really unusual because when you're returning the group that just had won it in 18 and you have all of them back and you've added some freshmen so your depth is even better, now you really want to win it. It's not perfect and it doesn't come easily, uh, but we certainly had expectations to repeat in 19. We all wanted to play Georgia in the finals just because they were our only loss in the regular season. I mean, we lost them in the semis of national indoors and that was a very close match. We lost 4-3, and it was tied at 3-all at one point in the match. Honestly, it would be the most fun uh, winning in the finals against a team that was your only loss in the regular season. So throughout the tournament, uh, that's, what we, that's what we all wanted, the coaches and all of us. We knew that February had not defined us as a team, and so we knew we could be a lot better than when we played them in February. So we were looking forward, but I mean, you can't look past anybody because we had a tough draw. I mean, we were playing North Carolina in the semi after we got the house Pepperdine. Uh, we had beaten them in 18 as well, but they're very talented. So you don't look forward either, but when we saw that Georgia had come through, it's like, okay, good. We're ready for them. Having been able to win three national titles in my four years here definitely is truly a blessing and I am just so proud of my entire senior class and my teammates, my coaches. You rely on these people and their experience and their desire to win and, um, and the talent level that we had and it, we're just able to uh, have done it amazingly uh, three of the last four years. It's very surreal looking back saying that we won three out of the four years just because every single year it was so different. Uh, my freshman year I played six singles and as an underclassman I really looked up to those older than me um, and then transitioning into junior and senior year, those are completely different years for me too. Lily's won 10 national championships now just as a head coach. She has been an incredible mentor to all of us. She's always so calm and like will take in every word you say and come back with more wisdom than you could ever imagine. I think the fact that our coaches are so confident in all of us really makes us even more confident in ourselves. And I remember Lily told us what the lineup was going to be minutes before we started the match. And so we were all kind of shocked because we weren't expecting it. But at the same time, we all felt very confident because our coaches were very confident in all of us. For doubles in the national championship, the final rounds, like I hadn't played doubles in about eight months. And one of our teammates got sick and I had to be put in. And that trust that um, Lily and Frankie put in of me to play that role of not having played in eight months was in incredibly confident boosting and it wanted me to make sure I performed um, to that level. If we don't feel like they support us, then it won't be um, our first nature to fight for every point like the Stanford way. I get asked a lot of times why we win so much. I also turn around and ask our players why they think we win so much because I their insight is hugely important. It helps me define things a little bit. And so I, I asked them the question at dinner a couple of months ago and interesting answers from everybody. I feel like we do have a culture here. I feel like when we get the right athletes into this program who are willing to accept Stanford and the academic challenge of it, want to have the athletic success as well, and when we can bring those people in successfully, then they have the right material to be able to be successful.